continue to work on Roche. And now you gotta try and make your uh, statement. Oh, we stole this? Get ready to witness the most craziest snatches in Dota 2 history. Oh, the hook shot! Era takes it! Make sure to watch till the end. Uh, I mean, I mean, let's go st straight to the video. Can they, can they do this with, with no one being around? That this bristle is the, the real issue. They've got to somehow break through or break around. It's Roshan. It's going to start to go down. Can Crystallize find the timing to make for the steal? It's falling pretty fast. He's going to have to go soon if he wants to try for it. Roshan getting low. He jumps in. Oh, he's got the Chrono. It's a good timing. Crystallize is going to be able to kill the Roshan. He's just still on the ground. Can he pick it up? He can. Crystallize. He's done it. He gets the steal. The Sonic Wave comes in from the side. Pushes back the three of them. Crystallize still alive. Turns over towards the Tiny. The toss-up's there. Crystallize turns over with the Time Walk. He's able to protect the Aegis. Gets out of this. Young G, he's also able to blink away. Magi. Limp is on bottom lane, actually. So he cannot touch this. I don't think anyone can. He's gonna try to rush down the racks, but um, that's not gonna happen. Eternal Envy is- Oh, Zephyr grabs it with the die. He snatches the Aegis. Now here comes EE with the stuns onto the Lich. They bring him down. ZR is getting roasted by the summer. They take him down as well. And Limp, he teleported back to clean it's up the TA. really tough GPK with no BKB. It's hard to come and contest this. Pushes everybody out of the pit. Yamage disposed onto one. They have the Rolling Thunder. Jumps forward. TM tries he to take it. it. He snatches it. TM TPs out with the BKB. Oh, DM the thief gets away, and look, they're losing rats too! Oh my god! To prevent the quick kill on the Death Prophet and combined with a quick execute on Danilku, who was scouted on the back lines and sniped by CK. Speaking of sniped, Sad Souls snatches the Roshan! No way! The Dyer actually get the kill, but Sad Souls just rolls in there and takes the Aegis off of them. How does that even happen? It's one thing to steal the kill, even gets a kill, gets the wicked six. Так, главное сейчас, чтобы Клокерк э, ничего не сделал, естественно, нужно позицию занимать, потому что он обходит, 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 он сейчас ворвется, кстати, под Рошана, и заснычил Аегис. Нет, просто провал. Конечно, забирают Рошана, are they going to be able to get out of two-man LSA? Oh. Cuckoo's back in. Another Ember's round of Sandstorm. Storm. Look at this, Magnus. He's dead as well. And you are had to just leave the fight. He's been caught by the Bedlam. He's going to mant up. But Cuckoo catches them again with the epicenter. Cuckoo comes in clutch. He just wins a massive fight for TNT. Unreal. And that all starts Arteezy's with... in. Wait, he goes in for everything. Arteezy, give me that damn Aegis. I'm out of here, baby. Oh, Unreal. my God. The definition of Aegis <laughs> Steel. What a boss. He's like, all right, team, you guys made some mistakes. I'll make up for it. come over? You got the disruption on the S4, so they'll send a whole bunch over. They get the dust early out, so S4, if he feels confident, he can move in. Roshan's very low. Wait for those illusions to oh. hit S4. Jumps in. Oh. He snaps the Aegis. Oh. He managed to take it. They're going to catch Skylark too as he goes for the lasso. But S4 teams up now with Anna. They'll bring down the Shadow Demon. And lasso stolen by t -Rex. This man. God, it does not actually describe him Mickey enough. Mickey goes on in, throws out that blood right tundra. They're all grouped together around it. Jumps out. They still have exorcism going down. Half HP on the Roche. They're Xing the Bloodseeker right now. And now the X onto Soxa to toss him back in. But then the X on X. And Mickey, he popped his PKB though. He thought he was being tossed back in. Oh, that is unfortunate. A weird mechanic, but ends but up getting caught. Oh Nisha steals it. The oh, what the hell? Dude, what, what am I seeing? What was that? But now the control and trying to bring him down. Skinner, he dies. Mickey came on in and beat the shit out of him. Saxa trying to get out of there. Nisha gets pulled away. The, well, walrus punch now. Connection on to Saxa. Nine trying to get out of there. It doesn't look like it's going to happen. Liquid say, heck no. Screw your Only Roche. We're it taking was. it all. They see how low he is. That may be enough for Fade to think about jumping. And he is. He goes in. He actually got the kill on Roshan and the Aegis of the Immortal. A full steal from Fade. The new thief in the night wants to go for more. He saw Warstomp from Mind Control. Miracle's gonna put him down. No, there's protection. War cries out, and Kuro is the one who's for in the pit. Yeah, get your Twitch clips ready, guys. Whoa. This could be it. Armel misses the arrow of the Sunstrike. Gonna give some vision, so now we can time it. He has a very good idea of when Roche is gonna go down. Zai 
poised to strike. Here comes the roll with a stun to follow up. He gets times it. it perfectly, gets the last hit as well. Zai Dota dies immediately. Wraith King, though, the one who dies on the TNC side, side does have reincarnation immediately. Arrow hits the DK as he goes bleaking, and they kill the Husker. Wraith King's got no way to survive his second life. He's going to go down as well, and 33 somehow doesn't die. Zai with a magical little play to get Optic Gaming back in game number two. They're not done yet. They're going to get our mail. The Sunstrike, not enough to kill him off, but Zai is there to finish it. Well, quite a bit of the second win. one's down to a quarter each. They're already. just focusing on getting the Roshan, which they will get. But the, oh, the, the, the fear. fear! He's in! The old Tiger! Oh, oh God, what a tiger. snatch! What a beautiful snatch there! Away from Shopify, you know, it's quite a hit to. To sort of the ag aggressive way that Shopify want to be playing, Shopify kind of need the sages. They kill this super fast too. They've got they've got a dying, and he's got a solo crest. So this Roche is dead. So they can go for a steal, Mikey. He's in. Yes. He gets, he's gonna get it. He gets the snatch, Mikey, and he no gets way. the shard as well. Didn't quite get the kill, but he takes everything else. What? I <laughs> hate Mikey. What a performance this game. He'll pay, he has roll up. I mean, the rest of Shopify are coming in to see if they can take this fight now. There's Mikey. He's able to roll up. Get pushed to the side here by Skidders. Tries to get in on top of him with the BKB, but Mikey's up on the high ground. He's going to be okay for now. Nine. Pots the BKB, but he's already so incredibly low. They surround 33 in the pit. 33 goes for the BKB TP out. It will save him, but nine will fall. I think it's just too difficult to defend. It's too low. Tornado, Tornado comes up. So bad. He Trying wants for it. the he wants initiation. It. The blow right to give vision. Sunstrike as well. Roshan's out of the pit. He's not taking any damage. So bad. Trying his best. Go in. Or spike. And he still he does. He snatches the Aegis. He dies. It doesn't matter. He takes away <laughs> the most valuable item here. And he's okay with to die with for this, honestly. Yeah. Uh, to hell to him. He's back to hell. Back again. The hesitant back. committing to finish the Roshan. They probably expect that he has buyback, but he actually doesn't have it. 30 seconds. Bavoka. Jump to the side, he's trying to burst through Chu and Tiger Mon is in with the backup, comes in with the BKB, jumps onto Chu! Chu's gone! Now it turns over towards the bar bar, plus the BKB, the arena as well, and Bone, he goes he got the the Aegis. the Aegis! Bone! He steals the Aegis! Can he get out though? Jump to the side, if BKB comes to an end, huge physical damage here for the slider fist of BZM. That's the Aegis taken out of the hands of Monet. Can he take a fight with his second life? Keep him in control with the stun, but the heals are there from PQ. Cold Embrace, buying Mono the safety to buy time and jump back up. Try and get this rope. There's a double damage bottom. I don't think anybody's going to get up before this next second. Ooh, FY? FY! Okay, he caught the Aegis! I was not expecting him to jump in there and grab that Aegis, but he ended up going through with it and grabbing it. Get the kill on Ollie. How much is this really going to matter at the end of the day? They'll buy back on this Lich. Onslaught in, looking over at Fly Fly. JT's already getting himself a little bit low. They've got the dispose to get the kill there on the JT. They'll take a BAB. Without this Viper, they fought back, go to the Solar Guardian, and now they're going to wait for him looking Burnade for Fritz. Turning his They're attention. The Necropunks are coming out. He'll have to beat the crap out of him to start with. Roshan down to 5k. VP, they need this. They need the Aegis as well as the Cheese. If they can have any chance against LFY being two racks down, against him, and it looks like for the moment, rolling boulder, Afu, he jumps in, where's the Aegis, he's that just that, Afu, you thief in the night, Afu wants to keep running, the site will put him down, but it only takes the Aegis, the there's an arena off cooldown, collapse, yeah, this is going to be close. The uh, spear comes through, Brawl jumps in, collapses there, though, gets the Aegis. Oh no, TSM, this isn't how it's supposed to go. Requiem is available for when this guy comes back. They want to get their revenge, but they're not going to go for it here. Uh, well, they will follow up regardless. Collapse does get imploded. Dubu dead on the side as Toronto Tokyo rolling through Moon Meander. Sableite with a BKB on the front line, just chasing back the side of Team Spirit as they will look over towards Mira instead. Gatora's racks in them, by the way. Is it in two or three? Oh, what the hell? That's not okay. Brawl has to come Remember, back. Remember, there's no RP for this fight. There's no Echo Slam for a full minute. So he can play relatively aggressive as he slights his way Fission in. Block. With the Flame Guard, will he commit for the steal? Roche, a, a 10th HP. He waves oh. in. He grabs the Aegis. He gets the kill, too. What a disaster for Nigma. And he's still alive in the pit, fighting on. Two dead. And the chase now going straight on to GH. Make it three. Absolute oh, no, catastrophe. Anyway, that is going to lead to the Roche. Very nicely done here from OGC. Oh, oh the hook shot. Era takes the Aegis. The Song of Siren just in time. Wow.